In this video, I'm going to show you how to get Springtomize 2 on your iOS device. Okay, to install Springtomize 2, you're going to want to open up Cydia. To manage, sources, edit, add, and add the source. Cydia xlis.com slash if you don't already have it. Then go to search and search spring to then scroll down until you see spring to mice 2 from XLIs. Click install and click confirm. I'll be back when it is done loading. When it is done installing, click Restart Springboard. You should have Springtomize 2 installed on your iDevice. Now I will show you some features in Springtomize 2. Okay, so you're going to need to enable Springtomize 2, and then, as you can see, you have a lot of stuff that you can customize. We'll start out with doc. So you can hide doc, hide labels, hide the reflection, hide shadow, use a custom number of icons in your doc, and you can enable a cover flow effect and adjust like the curve effect, perspective, and different modes. Okay. Then, the next thing I'm going to show you is lock screen. You can change the display seconds. Yeah, like in the time. You can have it so it looks like it's always charging. Um, always show WP. Disable camera button so you can't double click and the camera button show up. Always show camera button so it always has a camera button. High top bar up here. Disable artwork, so like the background, and delay dimming, so then you can adjust that here. Next thing is icons. You can hide the labels, lock, moving, disable jittering, disable uninstalling, disable all badges, two tap clear badge, use custom number, and five rows. There's folders. You can folder turn on folders close box. I don't know what that is. Hide preview, disable animation, hide background, hide label, disable badges, auto close, create and dock, use custom number of um, icons in your folder. Um, app switcher. Um, you can have a landscape switcher, so like you don't have to switch back into portrait mode if you're watching like a YouTube video or something. You can start editing, disable paging, start with iPod, disable badges, brightness slider, custom icons number, icons and switcher, inactive apps handling. Next, we'll do status bar. You can change your custom carrier. I have it as iTech John. Your custom time, and I have it as subscribe. You can hide the status bar items, all these items. Um, pages, hide dots, remove page limits, disable spotlight, disable paging, theming, custom dock, custom battery, custom font clock color for lock screen. Notification sensor, you can disable notification sensor, you can make it transparent, you can instant clear, you can have custom lines and the max lines there. And then when you're all done with it, you just click reload and then respring. Your device will respring. And then all the things that you did in Spring to My 2 will show up on your iPod. Now I didn't show all of the features of this because 
I don't really know what some of them do, so I don't want to tell you the wrong thing. So, but yeah, that's basically Spring to Mice 2. I think you guys should go get it, because it is very helpful to me. I use it a lot, like, every day, because I have custom things up here. I, yeah, I use it, oh, like, so much. I love it. But, yeah. So that's Spring to Mice 2. See you guys later. Bye.